Hi, my name is Dr. Michael Bell, and this video is entitled The Intelligent Child. Today we're going to talk about how children grow and learn, but particularly their cognitive development, the growth of intelligence in young children. I was reading an article recently by Carol Dweck in the Scientific American Mind about how our perception of the way children grow and learn has become a matter of acquisition of skills and abilities that are easily measured by adults. Intelligence is much more than that. I remember a book that I read by Daniel Pink a few years back, 2005, entitled A Whole New Mind, which really sound the alarm, called all of us to start thinking about right-brained thought as opposed to simply left-brain analytical thought as a means of solving problems in the future. It was a fascinating book and it got me thinking about how young children really come to become, really grow to become problem solvers in unique and interesting ways. We should change the way we think about childhood, not simply an acquisition of skills and abilities that we can observe, but really helping children grow into these expressive and creative and dynamic thinkers who solve problems for themselves, not simply adults fixing problems, not simply adults showing children, but really adults facilitating children as they play, explore, and grow into what I like to think are creative thinkers. Cognitive development is a balance between genetics, what the child has inherited, and also environmental influences. For many people genetics is a mystery and frankly I think with all the scientific technology we've just begun to scratch the surface regarding our genetic inheritance and what we are all destined to become. However, there's tremendous potential in each one of us. The environment all around us is observable, we can do something about it, and parents and teachers are actively engaged in really allowing children and providing children the best environment for them and allowing them to explore that environment. The psychologist Piaget poses a theory of cognitive development that is the foundation of modern thinking about how children cognitively process their experiences. His first stage, the sensory motor stage, which is birth to two years of age, is about building schemes and coming to understand the world by using their entire physical being to learn. It's a highly interactive model where exploration and sensory impressions using all five senses in order to learn about the world around them. Now, during the sensory motor period, children are beginning to classify and categorize based upon their entire being, how they interact with the world and their interpretation of all the things around them. The pre-operational stage is two years to seven years, and there's some big changes now, because children's thinking it begins to involve abstract symbols. Also, we see the beginning of make-believe or fantasy play. However, children do centrate or exhibit centration, focusing on one element of one object, or one bird call, or one element of their environment. One thing is the feature that they focus on and really don't pay attention to any other factors or any other aspects in their consideration. And also, this is a time of illogical thought. To summarize children's cognitive development during the early years, Piaget poses a highly interactive model that begins as a sensory model using children's physical being and moving on to more abstract thought where really a symbol system emerges. Cognitive development is an ever-changing process. It's not simply the acquisition of skills and information. It's a dynamic model that uses our entire being to learn. It's, it's self-directed 
it's exploratory, it's completely engaging. And if we think about our children in the future, this dynamic and creative model, which balances not only the information processing aspects of the left brain, the analytical side of us, but it also involves the right side, the creative thought processes, the way we interpret the world and the way we express ourselves, that's going to lay the true foundation that's going to benefit all children in the future. My name's Mike Bell and we've been talking about cognitive development. Thanks for looking in.